What happens to open source at those companies when they become part of VMware family? So typically when you acquire a company or when you sign a definitive agreement to acquire a company, one of the reasons you do that is for the, the smart people who are there, for the technologies that the companies bring, and of course, for the products and services. But in every case, if you look at open source, open source is about smart people, about smart technologies, about communities that have evolved around those. So when you acquire a company, you always want to try to sustain that because that is a huge part of the value that you get. Uh, the, the key reason to bring Haptio into the VMware family was to have Joe and Craig and, and the team of brilliant developers and the projects that they've created and the communities around those projects. So of course you continue to invest you continue to give them the ability to grow the communities, to grow the project that they've developed. It's not always that every single project aligns with what you want to do, but typically the majority of the projects that are out there, you invest in and you continue to grow.